Hello, hello, hello. I am here on the scene at this incredible space launch today. This is a very, 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 very exciting day for this town and for America. And I just want to get a little insider info on what's going on today with this amazing mission. You guys want to want to talk about what what makes today special? Uh, okay, I'll, I'll talk. I'm, this is uh, Dr. Jeffrey Snood. I'm here in uh, Houston today. And uh, we were very happy to see that this uh, launch has been such a success. Um, you know, we actually found this astronaut. Um, we, we, we did like a volunteer program because uh, we don't have a lot of astronauts chained at the moment. And uh, Gary Gary volunteered as our, as our first astronaut for this program. I feel like I'm going in and out of dimensions here. Wow. It, it, it's quite quite an interesting journey having a volunteer pedestrian uh, civilian from Earth. Um, but Gary Dallas, is a not Earth, Dallas. Okay, Gary is from Dallas, yes. But no, Gary, when I say Houston, I'm talking to Houston. Okay, Gary, I know you're from Dallas. Well, uh, you're cutting in and out of dimensions here. Okay. Hey. Well, so let me know, what, what was it about this gentleman that made him special, that made you choose him? What sets this guy apart? I would say his low IQ. Um, it made him uh, less fearful of all of the things that could go wrong. He's just really fearless. Uh, I'll, oh, wow. I'll agree with that. I'll agree with that. He's very fearless and... Um, you know, we've also, we're, we're doing some experimental, uh, special scientific stuff right now that we're trying to uh, figure out if we can send him through the black hole. And, you know, he was uh, oh. really excited about that idea. And uh, we, liked, we liked that uh, he didn't seem to have any fear about anything. Yeah, yeah the closer fantastic. I get to the black hole, I wow. keep fading in and out of the dimensions here. Okay, well, Gary, Gary, are you feeling okay? You're coming and you're going. You must be getting very close. I'm feeling okay. I mean, I still got all, all of my senses, I think. Um, uh, Gary's, uh, Gary's oh, no, heart no. actually, he, I, he's, his heart is beating very fast right now. I'm just looking at his vitals. But other than his heart beating faster and faster, uh, it seems to be okay. Oh yes. my God! Let me ask you this, That's guys. gotta be so the black I, hole. Well, I oh, thought it's beautiful. Oh no, he's I can't the black hole. not look at it. Gary, I'm going in. Gary, I'm gonna go in. It's too soon, Gary. Ah. Uh. Wow. Oh. So oh, is it? I'm back. Oh no, I'm he's back. Oh, oh, Gary, Gary, how do you feel? Um, oh, I feel like I. uh I feel like I have to use the bathroom, actually. Where do you go to the bathroom out here? Um, just um, go ahead and go in your suit, I would say. Yeah, just your oh, suit, Gary. Okay. Please leave your helmet on, okay? In training, you were removing it constantly so you could smell the fresh space air. Uh, just be sure to leave that on, Gary. Shh. I can't go to the bathroom when people are talking. All right. Well, this was a very special day. Wait, wait. Hold on. Oh. Just stare with me here. Okay. It helps if you just look right at me. Oh, boy. This is very uncomfortable, Gary. Well... You guys keep I talking. That, it's just going to take longer. I think that we've seen a lot of great stuff here today. We've got an average man in space. He's going to the bathroom. We got a black hole. Wonderful. Thanks so much, everyone. Oh, Gary, are you done taking a dump? Gary? Gary? Now I am. 